Starting with a blank drawing and the grid on, we will be creating a sine wave using the new Surface by Law tool. Once the Law Surface tool has been chosen, the Law Edit dialog will pop up. For now, go ahead and click OK and I will explain what's going on in just a minute. Now snap to grid to define the root point of the Law Surface. Tab into the Inspector bar and enter 10 as the value for both Umax and Vmax. Now switch to an isometric view. Select the Law Surface and open the Selection Info palette. In the Selection Info palette, expand the Surface by Law category. Notice how we have set up the space for the surface to be drawn. We have defined U as 0 to 10 in the X axis and V as 0 to 10 in the Y axis. The Z law, which is the sign of U, gives the surface its shape. Let's add some modifiers to the law to scale down the surface a bit. Change the Z law equation to sine of U multiplied by 4 divided by 4. This will tighten the oscillations of the wave and give us something to work with. 